Hey guys, and welcome back to a brand new demo. This week we have uh, the new gathering tools quality of life update with that includes the shifting sand mining pick which currently has the glyph of bounty grants a 33% to gain an extra strike while gathering. So if you have a look at that, uh, and what it looks like. Pretty cool. So that is the new gathering tool with Glyph. So Glyphs are basically um, kind of like infusions where you can... Oh, it shows it off here as well. That's awesome. Um, they are infusions that give you various bonuses to your gathering tools. So such as this one here, Lucky Dog used to give small chances of rewarding additional items. Uh, so what I'll do, actually, I'll go to a city, we'll show it off better. Let me go on. Let me go on, Caesarion's already in Divinity's Reach. So these new merchants will have, will offer glyphs for your gathering tools, such as of the tailor will give you random scraps, stuff like this, um, you know, Unbane Magic. There's a variety of them. Uh, I don't know where the merchant will be. I was just assuming it would be over here. Um, oh, yeah, exchange specialist. So the watchwork pick. Oh, so you can trade in all your old ones that had the bonuses already for ones with glyphs so that they'll be able to transfer onto other skins basically so the watch knight gives a uh, bonus watchwork sprockets the scavenger gives bonus fine crafting materials unbound gives unbound magic stuff like this so that's a really that's nice it. little uh, quality of life update and also you can transmute your gathering tools now which is really cool Except for some reason it doesn't... Oh, I'm in equipment, not wardrobe. That's why. So I can put all these onto regular finite versions for transportation charts. It's pretty cool. So we also have the brand new Inquest Mark II skins. I'm going to run through them quickly. That's the hammer. Or sorry, the axe. Not the hammer. The longbow. I don't really like the bow. Well, the short bow's a lot worse. Dagger's kind of cool. Focus. Ooh, that one. Great sword. The ham actually with the great sword. That's kind of cool. The way they don't light up when they're stowed. I like that. They kind of got like a, I guess, futuristic Saab, but Saab is a Surin, so I guess that's why they're sort of similar. There's the pistol, that's kind of interesting. The rifle. Hmm. Have the scepter. Looks very much like a torch. That's the shield. Interesting idea. Holographic. Staff, that looks, I don't know, interesting, I suppose. What's that like, actually, what's that like, wielded? Yeah. Uh, we have the sword here. The torch. Well, it looks very similar to the moot. And finally, the war horn. Yeah, so that is it for the Inquest Mark II skins. Oh, actually, quick little thing. You 
if you have bought the game, you can get a free Black Lion Glyph selection container, which gives you Glyph of the Tailor, Leatherworker Industry, which is completes 50% faster, or Flight, which increases movement after gathering. So if you're on a gathering train, you might want the Industry or Flight, if, you know, if you're getting your legendary weapons or armor and you're farming all the wood or whatnot. Um, Gift of Industry, or Glyph of Industry or Flight might really help you guys do that in a faster manner. So that is it for this demo guys. I do hope you enjoyed and if you want the chance to win the Shifting Sand Mining Pick all you have to do is head on over to my giveaway. It should be in the top corner up here. And yeah, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did and subscribe for more Guild Wars 2 content in the future. Take care guys.